12D model has a great tool for creating a rectangle by three points. It's found under the CAD polygons toolbar and it's the third button, third button out. I'm going to start by choosing the first point on my, on my rectangle, pick and accept, and then draft out to the second point, pick and accept, and define the third point. That's created an arbitrary rectangle on the screen uh, with the points that I, that I chose and the fourth point calculated as a, as a square. That's created an arbitrary rectangle on the screen. There are a number of other ways to define this rectangle and to demonstrate those I'll first of all delete the existing, existing rectangle using strings delete command and go back into my rectangle by three points. Once again pick the first point and accept. Now the last time I did this I just chose an arbitrary point here but at the bottom of the screen 12D is suggesting that I can pick the second corner or type in a bearing. If I type B for bearing I'm going to type in a bearing of 125 degrees, 15 minutes and 48 seconds. Press enter. I'm going to type in a length of 76, 75 meters and press enter. And that's defined the base part of the, of the rectangle. 12D is now asking me to define either a third point or to push R for radius, C for chamfer or L for length. If I type R for radius and I can type in a radius of 12 meters on the keyboard. That gives me 12 meter corners to my rectangle. Similarly, if I push C for chamfer, I can type in 8 meters, and that gives me an 8 meter wide chamfer on the corners. If I have a chamfer or a radius in place, I'm offered the option of N for normal, and I can uh, remove the chamfer and remove the radius. Finally, if I type L for length, I can type in the required length and 45 meters is my desired length. Press enter and my rectangle is created 45 meters.